The future division in the Department of Economic Development in Dubai is recently injected into the system. The aim of this uh, division is to look at the future and to look at the trends that is available either in the labs, international labs, or uh, produced in a white paper. And then we look at it from Dubai perspective. Then we look at the outcome of those two main ingredients and we try to come up with policies, regulations, or even procedures that affecting those future trends and economies. I'll give a small examples on what do we mean by future economies. One of those trends is the education pillar. And then the second one is the health pillar. And you have a mobility, we have retail, and we have all of those which are affecting directly the economy either of Dubai or United Arab Emirates. Education is going to change in the coming future. And the change is happening not in the curriculum only, but also in a physical existence of where student goes and get and acquire that information. Today, student goes to schools, universities, or institutions to get one-to-one -one or one-to-many information when it comes to uh, education. In the coming future, basically, future is today. What's happening today, you have many uh, institutions, accredited institutions, available worldwide. They don't have a physical campus, but they have existence on the cloud. Those existence on the cloud provides educational system with everything required, be it from the material, professors, interaction, exams, and basically, once you finish this, you will be accredited with internationally recognized certificate. This initiative started looking at the deep Africa underprivileged individuals or deep Asia underprivileged individuals. With the vast expansion of technologies and availability of devices, those uh, entities created such platform that will be available for everybody 24 seven. So everybody can get their educational need as well as the exam required to pass such a curriculum. The other big sector that we are looking at is the retail sector. The retail sector in Dubai considered one of the largest pillar. And there are recent move from the generation available today or even for the future generation, moving from bricks and mortar all the way to online retailing. Online retailer needs to understand the change of behavior of their clients. And we also, economic department, we are studying both sides. We are studying uh, consumer behavior as well as a uh, business behavior. And we try to come up with a bridge, creating that bridge between those two things when it comes to policies, regulation, or even uh, procedures to try to make both parties understand the way forward. And the recent example of movement from, or a shift from a mall dynamic is MR recently has announced the new Hor Dubai area. It is not a mall, it is not like a Dubai mall. Basically, it's a district and a mall in one place. So the integration of residency and retail are coupled together in order to give a similar effect of the old Dubai, where people are living around the malls or around the high street or around the souks at that time, and they are reinitiating it with the new technologies. Those are small examples that I want to pass on.